In the summer of 1816, we visited Switzerland and became the neighbours of Lord Byron. Then it proved a wet and genial summer, and incessant rain often confined us for days to the house. Some volumes of ghost stories, translated from the German into French, fell into our hands. We will each write a ghost story, said Lord Byron. I busied myself to think of a story. A story to rival those which had excited us to this task. One which would speak to the mysterious fears of our nature and awaken thrilling horror. One to make the reader dread to look around, to curdle the blood and quicken the beatings of the heart. 